How to Make a Fish Plat from the learnwithmrshern.com. And this is Tesna, and she's going to show us how to do a fish plat. Hi, Jennifer. Is it starts with a ponytail. You then take two sides, two even sides of the ponytail. If you come closer, Jennifer, you can have a look. Okay. So you hold it like this. Okay. You take your four fingers from the back of this one side. You take a little bit of hair and put it inside and grip it. So the only reason why they call this a fish plat is because it looks like a fish. When we're done with it, you do it on the other side. Little bit of hair with your forefinger. Over. Another part of your this side. Over. And I'll do it a little bit quicker so you can have a look and see. Because if you do it thick, then it won't look like a fish tail. So it actually looks like a fish tail. It ends up looking like the bones of a fish when you're done. But let me go a little bit quicker. Mikella, sorry for pulling your hair it's if okay, I am. <laughs> <laughs> um, just a little bit all the time. So plats normally have three pieces except on a fish plat. Fish plats you do two pieces. Oh, okay. So it would be two and under. It's, it's the same thing you do all the time. It's two Two small pieces all the time. Can you see, Jennifer, that yes, it's beginning to resemble a fish? Can you see that? Yeah, that's going to look cool. Yes. I didn't realize that you could do um, a plait with two you strands. You can. That's oh. the one way of doing a fish. Look, and you can do it in two plaits. You can have one here or one there. One high up, low, it, it doesn't matter. You know, you can experiment with your own hair. Or a friend's hair. There we go. See, it's beginning to resemble that now. Thanks for your patience, Michaela. Obviously, I'm not doing it as neatly because I want to show the girls. So, this is probably the easiest one to do once you know how to plait. Because this is just over. It says if you curl your, can you see that? You mm -hmm. take it, you curl your finger. You do it again, curl your finger. Another piece of hand, curl. There we go. Okay. And I'll go halfway, Jennifer. So okay. You can have a look. Sorry, Michaela, won't be long now. <laughs> it goes very quickly, though. It does, yeah. But you know, it takes a while to get used to. So if you're dealing with little girls, mm -hmm. they're going, they might have a problem in the beginning, but they'll be fine. They just have to practice. They can have a friend practice yes, by them. Yes, of course, and it's fun anyway. It's lots of fun. See, it's all, it's this all the time. Just all the time. So just ensure that you have two same amounts of hair okay. all the time on both sides. Great. And we just need a, an elastic, huh? Wow, oh, yeah. look at that. Huh? That's beautiful. Thank you. Nice job. Thanks to everyone at the Muse Hair Salon. Happy braiding.